now. At least I did. We are moving in the right direction. <laughs> That's at right. least I'll promise you football. <laughs> there we go. How about that? So, pull up the tape on October 26th. Yeah, it may not happen tomorrow right. for any game days, but I promise by next weekend it will start feeling a bit more like football weather. For tonight, not bad. The air is very dry, so for all the Friday night light games, you're getting to benefit from not only the dry air, but temperatures right now sitting in the 70s. Uh, we're noticing those numbers anywhere from 79 in Jasper, 81 in Tuscaloosa, with 80 82 in Birmingham. Looking ahead towards tomorrow, things are going to be dry as you start your day, so that means the air will feel much nicer. And you can see that by our dew point temperatures. Low 50s to our north puts us in the comfortable range. How about that? That's a change, right? Even the lower 60s, even though that's a little sticky, it's bearable. So lows tonight will settle in the lower 60s to our north, thanks in part to that drier air. Upper 60s from Northport down to Greensboro with a mostly clear sky. For tomorrow, some changes are on the way. Sunshine for most of us and for most of the day, but there could be a rogue shower storm late afternoon. Highs still returning to the low to mid 90s, and most spots will likely be flirting with record heat yet again. For tonight in central Alabama, 62 in Coleman, 68 in Birmingham. Highs tomorrow will range between the low and mid 90s. Now there will be a chance for rain in central Alabama, which could mean a little rain cooled air in some spots. Mid 60s in East Alabama with that perfectly clear sky tonight. Sunshine early morning, afternoon clouds in East Alabama. Maybe harder pressed to climb out of the upper 80s to our east, but low 90s from Piedmont to Oxford. And here's a look at those game day forecasts. Auburn fans heading to Gainesville, 86 for that kickoff. Here's something interesting. This will be one of the coolest games Auburn has played in all season long with those kickoff temperatures at 86. Little contrast in Birmingham, Sanford, you'll have 93. A few scattered showers are possible and UAB takes on Rice in mid 80s for that kickoff at 6 o'clock. So just keep in mind there will be a dry sky tonight, clear sky early tomorrow morning, but then those afternoon thunderstorms are possible starting at around 2 p.m. tomorrow. And notice they'll be right along I-65 and Interstate 20 with a bit more wet weather down to our south. There will be another wave of rain late Sunday into Monday, and that means another cool down. So we'll have two big bumps in temperature. The first one will happen Sunday as temperatures fall into the 80s. The next one will happen late Monday into Tuesday. Morning lows starting out Tuesday morning in the 50s. And that's a look at your storm team seven day forecast.